Hello. Welcome this evening to this event in honor of Stephen F. Gately, who was a professor at Francis Marion for 20 years before I arrived in 1993 and was with us at Francis Marion for 49 years. So quite, quite a distinguished career with us. Um, and so we are here tonight to honor him with the renaming of this gallery, as you saw when you came in, above one of his lovely paintings, the Stephen F. Gately Gallery. And now we have a presentation for the family. President Carter. Thank you. So, Gloria, will you bring the family up? <laughs> Come on, guys. Come up here and join me. We, we want to do two things. The first thing I want to do is talk to you just for a second about the resolution that the board passed naming the gallery. And the board didn't simply pass a resolution. Half the board are alumni. So the board wanted to talk about Steve, and they wanted to talk about Steve's contributions to the, to the university over time. And not every board member enrolled in his courses, but every board member knew who he was and the impact that he had on the university over time. They also knew his love of the university. I don't have to tell you it was a unanimously passed resolution and it was done with a lot of enthusiasm. Let me read the resolution if I might and then we're going, I'm gonna give you the resolution and then we're gonna walk right over there and we're gonna unveil something that will be placed on the wall when the permanent version arrives, which should be Daryl in about three weeks. Thank oh you. Goodness. So, uh, resolution 0322 for the naming of the Stephen F. Gately Gallery. Whereas Professor Stephen F. Gately served as a member of the fine arts faculty at Francis Marion University for 49 years, and whereas Professor Gately taught painting, drawing, and design to thousands of students who studied and excelled in the visual arts at FMU, and whereas all of those with whom he worked helped Professor Gately in the highest esteem for his love of teaching and his creative spirit. And whereas Professor Gately's exhibition record includes pages of national, state, and regional competitions spanning seven decades, including more than 20 solo exhibitions and whereas Professor Gately's art was displayed throughout the United States in numerous private and public collections, and whereas Professor Gately contributed to the university community through his thoughtful and reflective ideas, his attentive student mentoring, and his commitment to art excellence, and whereas Francis Marion University desires to acknowledge these contributions with a permanent and enduring tribute be it therefore resolved that the Board of Trustees for Francis Marion University hereby names the Stephen F. Gately Gallery at University Place. 3322. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank now, the second best part. Let's yeah. move over to the best. Over here. Okay. so much oh, to, to everyone, president, the board, 
the faculty, Steve's friends, all that you are here, that uh, again, he would just be cowering in the corner, being so upset that you were doing this. Uh, he would have hated it, hated it. <laughs> and uh, what a beautiful space. What a beautiful space in his honor. Thank you. I can't think of much else to say. Uh, please, okay, next. <laughs> when he came down to West Palm Beach twice a year to visit us, and we didn't see him that often up until the, those times, and he was very um, shy about his art or what his accomplishments. Once in a while, he'd send a, a newspaper clipping of a, uh, something he, an award he won to mom, and we'd see it, or he'd bring us a painting or two coming down, but never really said much about how close he was to these people here, you people. And I worried about him at holidays. Poor Steve, Thanksgiving, who's he with? Does he, does he have any friends? How many friends? Oh my gosh. I had no idea he was so close to so many people. And I just worried about him up here alone. And I didn't know he was so connected to the, this town because he never said too much. He said, yeah, a man of few words, remember? <laughs> so uh, we appreciate this whole thing because now we're learning more about our brother. It's weird how this all happened that we're closer to him now after he being deceased because finding out what kind of life he had and the impact he made on the school and the community and we're so grateful for this, believe me. Growing up with my brother, we were real close, but when college came, I was two years behind him, so we went to the same school. I stayed at FAU, he went on to Florida State. and. He was just like a normal kid. I come up here, and he's a superstar. I had no idea. I had no idea. When he'd come down to visit, he'd go to a gallery, have a family dinner, you know, didn't want to socialize a lot. I come up here, I said, I had no clue whatsoever. You'd be here, but wonderful. Yeah. It, it just, it's shocked. I didn't even know him, is what I'm trying to say. Exactly. In his later years. But I do now. I know all of you. Thank you so much for everything. Oh. Thank you very much. Uh, please enjoy the reception and, of course, mingle and mix among yourselves. Thank you. I love it.